military diplomatic mission, confers with German Chancellor Adenauer on Britain's proposed substitute for the defunct European defense community. Their talks cover old stumbling blocks like German rearmament and the nation's restoration to full sovereignty. The British plan is carried to Rome by Eden, where Italian Foreign Minister Piccioni greets him warmly. During his brief stay, Eden wins Italy's approval for the substitute pact, which calls for military, economic, and cultural cooperation among its signers. America's fast-moving Secretary of State Dulles, just returned from the Far East, embraces his wife, then chats briefly with the British and German ambassadors, and later, Italian envoy Torchiani, before leaving Washington for Europe to learn firsthand of the whirlwind developments. Eden, meanwhile, reaches Paris, where Premier Mondes France is at the airport to welcome him. The two leaders reach agreement on the British plan designed to overcome French objections to EDC while achieving its basic purpose. A difficult diplomatic mission ends on a note of new hope for Western Europe.